video is going to be about is uh, we had to take a trip up to our RV, RV site in March. We had an order a uh, shed kit and it wasn't supposed to be delivered for about 10 weeks, maybe even 12. And lo and behold, they brought it up three weeks after we ordered it. So we had to go up and we had to clear the driveway uh, and make room for it so they could put the shed in there. So anyhow, this video shows a little clip of how we cleared the driveway, what the RV site looks in the wintertime, and uh, how we all got it ready. And uh, then we went up later after it was delivered, and we had to check it out and see what was going on. So it's just a short clip in March, and uh, there will be one coming along when we uh, get ready to put the shed together. So enjoy this real quick clip. March in northern Wisconsin. This is the uh, snow that I uh, had to get out of the driveway. Uh, it was on the left hand side there. It was a foot or more deep. And it was very hard. I had to chop down with the shovel and a lot of work. I did finally get it done. Uh, I just ran the uh, SUV back and forth across the little bit of snow that I had left there. And here you can see they did drop it off late at night and they ripped some of the packing. So here you can see the tarp we had to put on it. And we tightened it all up. And uh, there's a view from the site looking back at the driveway. And you can see along the tree line there, I went over there because the sun had melted a lot of the snow. So it wasn't that much snow to go, but it was, it was pretty hard to get out of there. It's a beautiful day. About 28 degrees, bright sun as you can see. Uh, no wind. And there you can see there's some tracks right there and you can see what the uh, site looks like. Some of that snow there is two feet, maybe even a little deeper in some of those places there. And these tracks that you see right there, I tried to figure out what they were, but the sun had eroded the tracks so much and they actually get a little bigger when the sun erodes it and I couldn't really determine what it was. The only thing I was sure of was it was not a deer. Uh, it could have been several other things. I don't think it was a bear because they weren't still, they were still in their uh, hibernation. But anyhow, there again, it's a nice, pretty sight. Here you're going to hear it's walking on top of the snow. It had rained a little bit and uh, then it froze hard. And so some of that snow is two feet deep. We're walking right on the top of it. So we're just waiting for the melt so we can get up there and do something. If you like this YouTube channel or the videos like this, uh, please subscribe to it. Come on back and check us out every so often and let your friends know.